Introducing Gabe, an angel from humble beginnings, expert prankster. The Guardian School's best student without lifting a finger. Serafiel Malak, daughter of guardian angel Raziel Malak, member of the Guardian School's most prized family, studies her angel wings off and still can't keep up with Gabe. The final exam, protect and aid human runners during a race. The student with the highest final GPA earns a scholarship to Archangel Academy. Gabe needs only to help his runner place third in the race to get the scholarship. Seemingly a piece of angel food cake. Before the obstacle course races can commence, the runner's roulette must match each mortal runner with a guardian angel in training as a kind of kindred spirit. Gabe eagerly awaits the selection of his runner. An audacious runner. A true champion. A, um, uh, uh, um. Gabe appeals to Guardian School Director Professor Enoch, who insists that the runner's roulette never makes mistakes and that this new runner, Harold, is a new challenge that will teach Gabe that raw talent, hard work, and a humble heart are what makes a guardian angel truly great. Gabe insists that he's the most humble, and Professor Enoch insists that they'd better get that humble heart rate up by trying a practice course. Okay, student. This is Harold. He won't stop running, so we'd better get started. Press jump to help Harold get over that hole. Well done, student. Press jump to get Harold on and off that rope. Very good, Guardian. Okay, student. Let's practice your jumping skills on a few obstacle zones. That's the spirit! Keep going, Guardian! Impressive! Perfect, my pupil! That is a wing ring. Each one Herald collects will charge up your puff powers. Get one more to charge up a whole puff power. If something happens to Harold, a whole puff power puts him back in the race. But you can also use a whole puff power to encourage Harold. Try it now. Shocking! Now let's try that again with a jump. Be aware that when Harold grabs a rope, the puff power is cancelled. Don't stop now! Try that obstacle combination ahead! Oh ho! You will love this one! Jump at the edge of the ramp! Good race, Guardian! Looks like you are ready to learn how to manipulate obstacles. Just minutes after Gabe completes the practice course, Raziel and his daughter Sarah show up for their own practice session. Sarah feels confident and mocks the inferiority of Gabe's runner, Harold. His competitive instinct kicking right in, Gabe declares he has never been defeated and never will be. Gabe is more determined than ever to beat Sarah, even if he must do something he swore he would never do, study. To access each race, you must guide Harold safely through a practice course. Here we go. Your first obstacle is that wall. Flick right to damage the wall. Continue hitting the splendid student. But let's try that again. This time, try to break the wall before Harold runs into it. See those stars? Collect them all for an added advantage in the race. right to control the platform. When you are done practicing, help Harold across that hole.
When there are multiple obstacles, use the triggers to switch between. Great job, Guardian! <laughs> Move up and down to control the platform. When you are ready, help Herald reach the higher ground. <laughs> this is a challenging obstacle combination. Let's see if you can remember all you have learned. <laughs> this is a bridge. Hold left until the bridge is pulled tight. Don't let go. Once it is completely tightened, quickly flick right to help Harold across. Well done. Now try it once Harold has stumbled onto the bridge. Keep in mind, you can still charge it before he reaches the bridge. <laughs> Some platforms are connected and move together. Try moving the master obstacle and watch how they all interact. This is a drawbridge. Rotate to raise or lower a drawbridge. This is a noose trap. For maximum hit, <laughs> that makes me laugh every time. <laughs> the jungles have crocodiles that can either bite or roll over. Flick down to hit the crocodile. My, my, that was quite a reaction, but not what I was looking for. Let's try this. Quickly flick down. Well done. Wait for the crocodile to recover, then you can help Harold get past him. Congratulations! You have reached the end of the practice session. The next race has been unlocked. <laughs>
Congratulations, Guardian. You've unlocked your next assignment. As Enoch scolds Sarah for her rope-cutting interference, Raziel dismisses Enoch's disapproval as tiresome coddling and cites Article 17, Section 32, titled Interference Technique, as proof that such use of angel power is A-OK. -okay. While Professor Enoch maintains that every shortcut has its price, Raziel congratulates Gabe on his drive to win as an attribute that, unfortunately, not everyone in the Malak family appears to possess. In the name of kinship and fairness, Raziel is going to help Gabe even the playing field by teaching him the secrets of interference. Listen up, my boy. I am going to teach you how to create interference to improve your rankings. Let's start with the wall. Wait until the runner mounts the wall and then destroy it. Give it a try. It's fun. Did you see how your puff power increased? Every time you create interference to hinder an opponent, you gain the same power as a wing ring. Wait until a runner jumps before moving the platform out of their way. In my youth, I used to wait for them to step on it, then quickly yank it out from under them. <laughs> Perhaps I was wrong about you. Nice job, son. Interference is the key to keeping your puff powers charged. Drop the platform while they are in the air and watch them fall. You can also pull it up just before they run on. Classic! It reminds me of my days as a student. Against opponents, you must reverse how you charge up the bridge. Simply move right to charge, and then quickly flick left to watch the runners panic. Give it a shot. No, oh, silly humans. You cannot escape our protection. Your opponents will not stop to lower a drawbridge. Instead, they use the side planks to go around it. Quickly slam the drawbridge on the planks to shake them off. I really thought you were up to the task. You have to slam it down while they cross the planks. Okay, okay, you've got it. Don't waste too much time. I do have places to be. This one is my favorite. The more you charge up the trap, the more times it slams them into the ground. Ha <laughs> splendid! Hello? Hello? It's always fun using living things to create interference. Flick down once to anger the crocodile, and it will try to bite anything above it. Come on! One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two! One, two. Oh. Marvelous! <laughs> Ah, remember this? Now you will learn to do to Sarah what Sarah did to you. To cut a rope, just hold left and quickly flick right in one fluid motion. Try it. It's easy. According to the rule book, the rope will always be reset. So make sure to time your cut. Have at it, young one. Well done, son. You now have all you need to compensate for Harold's uselessness. I see great promise in you. Do not let me down. Gushing at how much greater Gabe's success is despite Harold's shortcomings. Raziel commends Gabe on qualifying for the first two races by embracing the interference technique and applauds Gabe's abilities, which are much more praiseworthy than those of his daughter, Sarah. 